fall off. If y'all don't start commenting and sharing and subscribing, it's going to be me and y'all. Yeah. Stop playing with me. Comment. Hello, my fault. Go to the video. Hello. Bring some of that royalty. What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Neek G, the host, and today I'm back with another reaction video. Before we go any further, make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe, and share this video. You dig what I'm saying and what the goddamn hell you leave. So, y'all, um, two things. For one, I'm doing a 24-hour stream on Twitch, April 22nd. You dig? The whole 24, we about to really, really tap in, okay? So, y'all make sure y'all be there, man. Twitch.tv slash Royalties World CEO. Um, you know, I'm on my stream right now and somebody said, uh, you know, look at Clarence stream because apparently him and my not talking no more. He spoke about not talking to mod anymore. And I wasn't going to talk about that because it's kind of sticky, you know, good talk. Um, let me see when he said, I that. know some of y'all needed that too. That was a good talk though. We might skip that part, but I'm okay with that. Um, if voice posted, it, then I'll tap into it. I don't know if she's going to post it or not. Uh, I think she is. But what I want to talk about is him speaking about his father. Now, y'all know I give story times vicariously through my videos and through other people's situations. So I want to react to this um, because he was speaking about his dad. And he he's really hurt by it. And um, I just want to give y'all a tell y'all a story time about what happened with me and um the lady that had me i don't necessarily call her my mom at all um and i'm like i don't want to tell y'all her name but yeah let's get into this i don't know what part he on right now um you can't eat up you can't heat up tuna fish gang shit when i put hot eggs in tuna fish it'd be hot i, I think it's better when it's hot Yeah, too saucy. Niggas do be on dick. You about to get yeah, I'm not. It. Yeah. I have family members that do the same. I'm not going to lie, bro. This one, you about to get into it. Not to get deep again, though, bro. <clears throat> one thing that hurt me, bro. Like, was my, my dad called me for the first time from jail, right? My nigga didn't even say hi, bro. That's crazy. And all that they did to make sure his dad was straight. You know what I'm saying? Like, <clears throat> his dad whole life going through a damn M-word case. You know what I'm saying? It's all over the internet. And everybody was on Clarence peeing about it, like real bad it was like yo <laughs> i i didn't do it you know what i'm saying and um for his dad not to even speak is terrible but he gets deeper into it he'd even say hi again you just ask for money bro that's terrible Tough. It's tough, man. He's definitely admitting it. Like, I understand. I know he's in like a desperate situation. I know he he in a fucked up position, you know. But damn, bro. You know what I mean? Like, at least say hi. Like, you feel me? Something. Like, damn. So, I want to give y'all a, a, a quick story time of my situation. You know what I'm saying? Um, a, a lot of y'all are new, so a lot of y'all don't even know. But, you know, here goes. So, I my father married um, his wife, which he married her when I was five. She's been taking care of me ever since then. Shout out to her. That's mama. Right? That's my mama. But the lady that had me. So I went to go see her um, 
not her. I went to go see my brother because he was getting married. And um, my brother's 10 years older than me. So I go to the wedding and shit. I see her. I'm like, what's going on? I, I was a nervous wreck to see her. Hadn't spoken to her in years. Didn't know how that was going to go. Didn't know if she was going to even talk to me because she's just a fucking weirdo. So, you know, I'm like, hey, how you doing? Oh, what's going on? How you? Da, da, da. Fake ass love, right? You feel it. Before that happened, she used to call me when I started this YouTube shit. She used to call me like, yeah, you doing good, man. You need to send us some merch or send us some something. It was always send us some something. And I used to say all the time, I got you. Yeah, I got you. Okay, yep, yep, I got you. Yep, got you. Never sent it. Um, And I didn't because it was just like, I'm not making you a priority. Seemed like you're only making me a priority right now because you might be proud of something that you had no, you didn't put in on, right? See her at the wedding. Uh, long story short, she asked me for my social security number, right? And it's like, my social? <laughs> you should have it, right? But she asked me for my social security number, y'all, and... boy I'm only getting emotional right now because Clarence got emotional because I haven't been emotional about this um but I was just like what y'all if if your heart drop in front of the person that's hurting you like you can't ever let them see you sweat right not even your fucking mama so I was just like damn so what I told her was, just give me yours, right? Because the reason why she wanted my social is because she she got she got something for me when I was younger that I needed from my mama, right? Let's just go school. She helped me with school. And she pushed me to go to school because she wanted me to get the refund check from school, right? I get the refund check. She wanted a piece of the refund check. Hmm? After wanting that, now you got to pay that refund back. So what she wanted to do was take my social and tell the, the, uh, the people that she got the loan from to take the shit from my taxes because now she don't get taxes no more. And I said, damn, I mean... I was born in 89 and I ain't seen you. And it was like, what, 2020 at that time? It's 2020. <laughs> 89, 2020. I'm 30. Man, this shit for me. The least you could do is pay your motherfucking taxes. You know what I'm saying? So after that, right? I'm trying to be an adult like, you know, my mama is talking to me like, don't treat her like that. You know, she always been that the woman that took care of me. Don't treat your mama like that. You know, she um, my mom was on drugs, you know, but she's no longer on drugs. So it's like, what the fuck wrong with you? So. She kept sending me pictures of my brother, y'all, and I have an older brother and a younger sister that. um lives you know where they live or whatever and she always send me pictures of them right and I'm like why you keep sending me they pictures like it was starting to piss me off right so I'm like yo and it was always around my birthday she had sent me a picture of them so I'm like yo I don't know if you think this make me happy or what it is but stop sending me pictures of y'all I don't want to see that shit like, you can show them love and, and, and give them time and all that, but you can't do that for me. I don't like that. Stop doing that. It don't make me feel good or whatever. And she was like, um, basically, she told me I wasn't a, her child. I was her sister. That's what she said. You ain't nothing but a, because sis came out of it. Something sis. And she was like, that's all you are to me is my sis. And I was like, what the fuck did I do to this lady? 
Like, I, I, I ain't gonna lie, I was brought here for, for certain reasons or to take certain things. And I'm a strong human being, y'all. Most of the time, I first it hurts, then I'm pissed, then I'm over it. I don't give a fuck. So I had to do that with her. And the problem was, you know, when I spoke to her one day, I was falling out. I was a mess. I'm like, yo, why you don't love me is what I asked her. I was drunk as hell. Called her or text her. I'm like, you know, I love you. Ain't no way I can't love you. But and got to talking about my daddy for like an hour. And I'm like, why are you talking about my dad? Like he never talks about her ever. And she always talked bad about him. So she's doing that. And I'm just like, yo, like, you know, you are so angry at whatever my dad did to you that you can't even love me. And it's sad that that's, that's reality for some girls. And it might be some reality for some uh, boys, you know, and I'm talking young boys and girls. But, you know, you grow up and you become a woman and you grow up and you become a man and somehow can still be shitty to your fucking children. <laughs> and, y'all, you know, as an adult, see, now, thank God for Titi, because she had, she was like, baby, she don't fuck with you. That ain't your mama. She don't fuck with you. And she was like, you... You're going to have to accept that shit. And because I was crying, y'all, I was so upset. And um, she's just like, listen, you know, sometimes you you got to be honest, man. And and you got to respect the people that's honest around you, you know. And if you can't be honest with me, we can't be friends, my nigga. If, if I can't be honest with you, we can't be friends. You know, and or or I can't be with you, you know, but she told me just like that. She ain't your mama. She don't fuck with you. She don't even think you her child. She don't even look at you like you're her child, you know, and I was like, you right. And ever since then. I'm good, man. You know what I'm saying? Um. I've come to terms with it. I'm at peace with it. And at the end of the day, I'm grown as hell. You know, I'm going to be better to the kids that I raised than what she was trying to do to me. You know what I'm saying? And that's why I was itching to have a child so bad, y'all. Uh, but I don't want one now. <laughs> I got two. I'm, I'm done. I'm done. But I had to give y'all a quick story time. Hey, what up? Like, you know, like, how is Legend Tour's just doing? the one time in life like, there's like... no album to hand in. Oh, that's a damn life to ad. I'm like, what is it? Okay, the ad gone. And I know he, he hasn't been there, like, you know, like a father should, you know? But, like, I love him, though, you know? <laughs> He loved the hell out of his dad. And, you know, Love you too, friend. Getting older, my mom just told me like you know, you just gotta uh, you gotta love your dad uh, for you, you know, not for like him. Mm. You know. And see, I can't do that. So you you know what y'all know what I've been thinking about? Cause you know she ain't young. When she die. What would do? That's what be on my mind. Like, I'm on some Tupac shit. Like, my anger wouldn't let me feel for a stranger. So I, they say I'm wrong and I'm heartless. But all along, I was looking for a father. He was gone. You know what I'm saying? Like, that shit real. So it's like, what would I lose? You know what I'm saying? Why would I go? It's just crazy. That's what I've been thinking about, though. Just so y'all know, it's what have been on my mind. Yeah, we be having a good relationship here and there, but it comes to the point where I be feeling used, you know? That's hurting that man. Like, I... I um... and, and see, me, that's why I be telling y'all, like, 
Like, yeah, Neek, my mom, da da da. <laughs> the mama that raised me, she don't want shit from me. Nothing. Nothing, nothing at all. You know? And a person like that deserved the world. You know what I'm saying? Um, but. If she were to ask me for something, bitch, I wouldn't give you a glass of water. Wouldn't spit on you if you was on fire. It's that bad. You know what I'm saying? So for him to have a heart like that, it's a good thing. It's a good dude. I always felt like Clarence was a great dude, man. It's just tough, bro. Mom Dukes is doing good, bro. Mom Dukes is good. I love Mom Dukes. My mama don't want shit, but nah, I don't, don't care. Shut a tear, girl. Facts. It's my life. Um, he's not the only person I've dealt with that with. Like I'm so used to it, bro. But like, facts. It just hurts when it comes from someone you care about, you know. He's, that's bothering him. I'm good. I'm good. I'm in a good mental space. And you can tell that I'm in a good mental space that I was able to share that, you know? Facts. And um, I really shared that to show you that, like, you know, some people are going to be who they are, you know, but, like, never change who you are. Yeah, it hurt. You know what I mean? But am I going to send him money? Yeah. Fuck no. You know? Better than me. I ain't gonna... I'm not gonna leave my dad in there, uh... You know, starving and shit, you know? And maybe they... The thing about my pops, he looked out for everybody when he was out, you know? And see, that that's exactly what I was about to say. He got a different reason. All his, all his kids... All, Come on, Ed, all chill out. uncles, you know? <laughs> But everybody forgot about him, which I know it got to be tough, bro. Imagine I, sometimes I put myself in his position if I was in jail and Queen, everybody, my mom, everybody just forgot about me and just left me to, um, left me to die in there. That wouldn't be a good feeling, you know. And knowing him, he's like a, he has a lot of pride. Nah, facts. So I, I mean, you know, I still have a good heart when, when I'm done wrong, but that mama situation, that shit hit No, different. him even asking me. God damn it. It's hard on him. So. Yeah, I um, I had bonded him out. I had got him out of jail, but it was only during the court process, you know. And then he got sentenced, so mm. he got he got a he had to go back in, you know. But I really just wanted him to be out so he could meet Legend one time, you know. Damn. Uh, pay all that money just so he could see Legend one time. Damn. Well, a few times talked to him on the phone and stuff. Legend knows who he is. Legend calls him grandpa and stuff. And that's all I wanted, you know? That shit crazy. I have I have a soft t side to a certain to a certain extent, but I'm sorry. Not a glass of water with her. Nah. <laughs> nah, nah, nah. Allowance pro tip. To save money on wireless. Sorry. Not sorry. To 
<laughs> All right, I'm about to be done with this. I don't know how Clarence be a pause for a minute. Yeah. That's all I wanted for for them to meet, you know? Like, he he heard stories about him. My mom sent him pictures, but he never got to meet him, you know? So. That's, that's dope. He, wanted, you, you see, the, another reason. He did that for his son. Man, you know? uh, he did that for his, his baby. Uh, older, that's different. Older that gangster, dope. man. Kind of stuck in his ways, so you know, my dad. That's what my mom was saying. He's not gonna ever change. It's like kind of too late. Facts. So you just gotta, just gotta love him the way, you know, the way he is now. Um, he's not. Nah, here. you know, he's passion not here for the rest of his life. Passion. Uh, I think he got. Um, Hold on. I think fifteen to twenty. Damn, that's a long ass time. Um, I'm not. It's not about. Um. Being weak. I I really don't care how people perceive me. I'm okay with that. Uh, people had they per, people have their perception of me before. We even say, hey, because they see me on the internet. I've gone through shit. You know, I always get that, Neek, I thought you was, but you ain't even. You know, in the back of their mind, they already feel some type of way about me anyway. So, I don't be acting no type of way. If I fuck with you, I really do. And if I don't, I really don't. Mama and all. Hell, she ain't raised me. She ain't take care of me. She had me. You got your 10%. You know what I'm saying? I mean. And then you, I, even if I tried, you know, you tell me I'm a sister. You can't love a person who don't love you. How can you do that? That's why I feel 50 cent on his son. Like, nigga, act like he don't love him. You know, his own son act like he don't love him. How can you love a person who don't love you? And people would think that's crazy. Like a the woman that has you, she don't love you? Nah. You know what I'm saying? Like in, in real life, it's a no, Jack. So you can't love who don't love you. You know? So that's why I'm 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 only and forever for the rest of my life gonna focus on who loves me. And if that's just me, cool with that too. You know what I'm saying? I love the hell out of myself. I have great intentions with whatever I do. I don't do everything right, and I ain't here to. Because y'all damn sure don't either, you know. But, you know, it is what it is. I I, I tell you what, I ain't sad about it no more. Um, I, I've accepted it, and that's okay. That's okay. Life goes on. But uh, we're going to end this video. We had 22 minutes. I wanted this to be eight minutes. Um, but Nick, you're a child of God, right? So we know we have to forgive hun. Um, she's forgiven. I wouldn't be able to talk about it if I didn't forgive her, but that don't see passion. Don't misconstrue fucking with a person and dealing with their shit because they're a parent or because they're anything you know what i'm saying like i you, wrong girl wrong girl being a child of god a child of god you are supposed to forgive she been forgiven but i don't have to fuck with you even though i forgave you i'm cool on that you know what i'm saying somebody said he about to get into my to god so let's just see he he taking a minute i think 15 to 20 years yeah nobody's gonna stress me out no more while i'm here you know what I'm saying? So, shit. It is what it is. He already spoke about my... We seen that before he even spoke about his dad. Is he going to say something else? That's a long-ass time, so... Y'all also know my brother Chael died.
Y'all can hear it. Damn. His dad got 15 to 20, he said. That's his firstborn. I know he going through it in there. I just feel like I'm all my dad got, man. I'm all my dad got, man. It's hard. I'm have to. I'm have to take Legend up there, but I don't want to take Legend to fucking jail just yet. Man. Look like he's about to say Rikers. Nah, don't cry, bro. Don't cry, bro. I know there's a lot of people going through worse shit than me, bro. So this ain't no sob story. Just sharing things that just a little bit of what I go through, man. Yeah, one more one in the chat. Y'all, let me know what you think down in the comment section below. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hell yeah.